lights up on an empty stage. There is no action for several moments. Soon, we hear the sound of a door opening and a woman, Susan, steps onto the stage, looking around briefly as if she is expecting someone. She is about 28 to 30 years of age, attractive, dressed nicely, a friendly and sunny demeanor to her face. She's not alone for long, though, as soon we hear the sound of another door opening, and a man, Jacob, walks on. He, too, is around 30, is dressed nicely, has a friendly demeanor, etc. Jacob is the first to speak. Um, hello? Anyone here? Hi, over here. Ah, there you are. Jacob slowly walks over to Susan and stands before her. He is somewhat nervous and bashful. Hi. Hi. So you're Susan, right? Yes, uh, I am. And you're uh, Jacob? That's me. Nice to meet you. Likewise. Gosh, you're really pretty, Susan. That's very sweet of you to say. Thanks. You know, you're quite good looking yourself. Ah, gee. Thanks. So. So. We, uh, we both know why we're here, right? Yep. Yep, yep, yep. That whole, uh, kissing a stranger video project they're doing. Yeah. Kissing a stranger. Kissing a stranger. On the lips. Right on the lips. Yeah. The lips. So, don't take this the wrong way, but I, I really don't know how this works. Me neither. Not the kissing part, of course. I've, I've been kissed plenty of times. Oh, me too. Me too. I, I just meant how, how this whole project comes into play. I think that camera is, there is what records people who are paired off. Oh, yeah? Wow. Fancy stuff, huh? Yeah. I'm so used to filming things on an iPhone. I forget there's fancy looking cameras like that for filming. Same here. Yep. Yep. So. So. I guess we just lock lips then, huh? I, I guess so. Uh, Susan, you look kind of nervous, uncomfortable. If you don't want to do this, you don't have to. I promise I won't be offended in any way if you'd rather not do this. I can just tell the guy outside that we're going to just head out. We won't get paid, but I don't want you to be uncomfortable. No, no, no. It's cool. It's cool. But thank you for giving me that option. I appreciate it. Of course. I've just... Yikes. I can't remember the last time I kissed a guy. I can't remember my last kiss with a woman either. Single, Single life, life, right? Jinx, Jinx buy me a soda. soda. <laughs> <laughs> You're cute. I like that. You are too. No, I'm not going to wimp out. I promised my girlfriends I would do this. They said it would be fun. They said it would be a good way to get me out of my single life funk and dating slump. My friends signed me up for this as a prank. I was kind of annoyed, but hey, it seemed like intriguing fun the more I thought about it. Plus, we're getting paid, remember? Yeah, anything to help with rent money, right? Right. So, um, I guess let's just do it then, right? Right. An awkward silence. The two stare at one another, both unsure as to how to proceed. Susan finally, slowly, puckers her lips out. Jacob also puckers his lips. The two lean in slowly, but about halfway to their lips connecting, 
both stop and unpuck her in unison, losing their nerve. I, uh... I am so sorry. You're, you're fine. You're fine. I, I don't want you to think it's because of you. It's totally not. You're cute as heck, and so far you've been very sweet and polite, too. And it's not because of you, either. You're pretty and, and nice and funny. Aw, gee, thanks. Okay. Um, you want to try again? Yeah, sure. Again, an awkward silence. For a second time, Susan puckers up, as does Jake. The two lean in to kiss, but once again, nerves get the best of them, and both turn away shyly. Oh, boy. I feel like such a jerk right now. I swear, I swear, it's not you. Susan, Susan, you're fine. Please don't worry. I'm nervous, too. I'm glad I'm not the only one. I just don't want to kiss you wrong, you know? I want to make it a nice experience for you and for the camera, too, I guess. Uh, does, does that make sense, like, at all? Jeez, I'm rambling, aren't I? Oh, I promised myself I wouldn't ramble. You're fine. Don't worry. And it does make sense. I appreciate your concern. I was thinking the same thing, too, to be honest. Okay. How can we make this less awkward? Make ourselves less nervous? Hmm. Good question. Oh, oh, I got it. Yeah? Why don't we just ease into it? Like, we could peck a few times on the lips. Hmm. Gee, that's not a bad idea. If we peck a few times, we'll be more at ease for the actual main kiss. Exactly. I mean, if you're fine with it, I'm fine with it. I'm fine with it. Awesome. The two take a step closer to one another and smile. Soon. They both pucker up, lean in, and peck on the lips gently. A beat. They peck on the lips a second time. Another beat. They peck on the lips a third time. After the third peck, they both step back and smile. That was so nice. It was nice. So, um, now what? Huh? Huh? Oh, right. Now that we eased into it. Yeah. I mean, maybe we could hold a kiss now? For like a count of five? Just press our lips together? Good idea. It's a step up from a peck, right? Right. The two smile and link hands. They lean in and their lips connect in a gentle kiss. They hold this for a count of five, then break off and smile again. Wow. Wow. That was even nicer than those pecs. It was. It really was. So now what? Could we just try the actual main kiss? I had one more idea. Yeah? Why don't we try one more easing an exercise? You kiss me for five seconds in your way, and then I'll kiss you for five seconds in my own way. Deal? Deal. Susan smiles and eagerly puckers her lips out. Jacob smiles leans in, and gently, sweetly, kisses her on the lips for a count of five. He soon breaks off the kiss as Susan's eyes dizzily open. The two are all smiles. Jacob now eagerly puckers his lips out. Susan smiles, puts her hands on his cheeks, leans in, and kisses him on the lips for a count of five in her own way. She finally breaks off. Oh, wow. Ditto, you, Jacob, you are a really, really good kisser. So are you. So, 
main kiss? Main kiss. The two embrace and deeply kiss one another passionately for several seconds. Suddenly, we hear the sound of glass popping and breaking. Jacob and Susan break the kiss and look around in confusion. What was that? I I don't know, but I heard it too. He did something fall or did it? Oh, no. What is it? I, I can't say for sure, but I think we overheated the camera and it burst. <laughs> no way. Look for yourself. Holy cow. We did. The heat of our kisses? I think so. Hey, you think we could go get a coffee together? You read my mind. I'd kind of sort of like to see more of you. Ditto. Shall we? We shall. There's just one thing we need to do first. Oh? What's that? Explain to the people filming that we inadvertently broke their camera and hope to God they don't make us pay for it. It looks expensive as hell. <laughs> we'll do half and half if that's the case. Besides, it'll make for an awesome story to tell our friends, right? <laughs> <laughs> With that, hand in hand, Susan and Jacob laugh, head off stage, as we completely fade to black.